Thank you for watching this video. Subscribe to my channel. This video isn't that much a reminder. It's just something I want to point out to you. And I am pointing this out to those that have been following me for a while. Especially those that have been following me for more than a year. You know that I, that I always tell people to look at the bigger picture. You know that I always tell people to agree with Christ. Now continue to say that because that's very important. I want to highlight something else to you that you may not notice. When people realize they can't have a will for, for free towards you, haven't you noticed that they either shut down completely from you or they frighten and back off when they see you? Let me tell you why. Because in the world, people can will whatever they will towards anyone, even become hostile and negative and people can get away with it in most circumstances because they have their reasons. But when you are in agreement with Christ and you operate in the supernatural, people can't will whatever they will to, towards you. And if they are direct towards you, you need to look out how they are direct towards you. They cannot have an opinion however they want about you. They can't. Because when you are in agreement with Christ, that means you are operating in the safety. That means that all danger against you must be destroyed and cancelled out. So if anyone has a will or a view of you that is contrary to Christ's safety, they are in trouble. I don't care if it's the way you look or the way you talk. If they have a will against you, they are in trouble. And sooner or later, they will notice this. And they will also notice that if they continue holding on to that will and keep fighting, it's them generating negative energy. It's them being hurt and, and harmed by that energy. It's them that's being destroyed. So anytime they see you, they're reminded of this. They are faced with this reality. And this is the reality they don't want to face. So when people realize that they can't will for free towards you, don't be, don't be um, surprised when they shut down from you or vanish. Praise the Lord they're vanishing because what's the alternative? The alternative is they are so encouraged by the world to will against you and generate negativity against you and to fight against you. Once people realize that, whoa, you can't will whatever you want against the individual, look how they change towards you. And there are times people will let you off the hook. Maybe you said something that others didn't like. Normally people would, would put a reaction against it, but because it's you, they know they're not going to put any reaction against you. They'll, they'll suck it up and deal with it. Because they know standing up for themselves means consequences on them. They don't want that. When you walk by faith, you will get away with a lot of stuff. I'm not talking about you harming people because you don't intend to harm people because you agree with Christ. But when you walk by faith, you are freed from many of the unexempt restrictions that world people hold on to. And there will be times people will just walk away from you or run away from you instead of confronting you because they know that what they will, what they're upset about, they can't legitimize it, they can't defend it. If you were a worldly individual, well, they could have dared to act up against you or say things to your face of that, but because you operate in supernatural, they know, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, not here. I've experienced this. So if you experience it, don't be sad about it. Rejoice. That means your enemies are fleeing from you. And if they're fleeing from you, let them flee. Don't chase an enemy that's fleeing from you. Come on now. The fact that the enemy is fleeing from you shows that you have won. So when Satan flees from you, let him flee. Well, that being said, agree with Christ and be at peace.